Hello and welcome to another episode of Farming Simulator 22 on Somerset Farms. Um, we've got quite a little bit of work to do today, guys, including cutting the car, the sheep area. I know it's a cow. Um, yeah, basically, these are almost out of food. We've got no grass in storage at all. So we'll use a little mower, we'll get them some food. Um, but yeah, the, one of the main jobs today we have to get this field done this field needs to be um this field needs to be re-plowed out it it doesn't have a choice it has to be re-plowed due to the fact that um we can we're not going to harvest what's in this crop since we bought it we're only going to put grass in this field um it's going to be nothing major it is going to be our hair supply um So yeah, that's that's kind of gonna be uh, today's plan, really. We've got us, we've got to start producing here. Um, cows are gonna need feeding again soon, things like that. So we need to get um, we need to get a hay supply. Like I say, we do have a little grass field. It's absolutely pathetically tiny. Can't really do anything with it, to be honest. Um, that's why we're doing. Uh, doing a slightly bigger field. I say we've still got a little bit of money in the bank. I'm hoping to maybe get another field as well today. It would be nice. Um, again, not the end of the world if we don't. But we will be getting another field. It just may not be today. Um, I'm thinking, to be honest, that we need to get a really good mower now. Like a really, really good mower. The mower, was, the mower we've got is just like a small front mower and I think it's about time that we um, we got a decent size one to be honest. You're not really doing my head in today little tractor. You're just doing nothing but wheel spin. Hopefully now that's done that. What it is, is I need a weight on the front. And uh, honestly, I can't be bothered to go to the shop and buy one. Um, now it's also a little bit underpowered, this, uh, this tractor for this job. Which is one of the reasons why I'd like to buy a, a new tractor. We haven't bought a new tractor in such a long... This was the last one we bought. Um... We're going to have to get, we're going to have to pick up stones and everything, can't we, today? I'll tell you what, um, we don't need that and that. Let's get a worker doing that, because to be honest, I can be doing something else. We've got loads, and I mean loads to do today. Um, cutting this grass in this field once a year pretty much covers me for a full year. Um, should be the right mode. Yep, fantastic. Yeah, it pretty much covers me for a year. Um, I think we did it in June, didn't we? Last time, and it, it'll run out in May, so it's almost a year on the su on the supply of grass. But obviously, we need to have more in cost. This is quite a time-consuming job. Um, now, in theory, we could just back get home, get a big mower. Technically, would speed the job up. But the, the thing is, I very rarely get to use this little mower, and I kind of really do like using it, to be honest. That's why we're using it. So while that's in there plowing away, getting rid of all that, I'll uh, I'll get in here and. Let's cut across there. We'll do this field in two sections, I think. Yes, that works. And then if we go back this way. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't feel like we're getting a lot of grass off this. Is this not fully grown? I know obviously it's ready to harvest, otherwise you wouldn't let me cut it. I don't feel like we've normally filled this up a lot by now. Um, why does this feel like it's not giving me as much grass? That's not good. At all. Turning around there. But yeah, the sheep have to be fed. Um, open to jump to May soon. Again, like I said, I'd like to try and get a bit of grass planted in this field before we do, you know, in that field there. Um, gonna have to do a little bit of liming, I think. We definitely need to go and get the stones picked up. But we're gonna have to rent a couple of machines. Yeah, something's not right here today, guys. This is not yielded very well whatsoever. This... Yield bonus, 98%. What the hell's going on with this field? We used to have to empty this, like, loads. Like it would never do a headland. And yet this time it's done half a field and we're still not full. That is really, really not good. Um, right, okay. I'm a little bit concerned with the grass situation right now. actually that is definitely something is wrong with the with that hmm oh hang on it's only stage one harvest that's why yeah it's only stage one harvest I mean, as much as it's giving me a, a good yield, it's not giving me maximum yield, right. Fair enough, it's only stage one cut. Yeah, I wasn't really paying attention. Um, but I needed to cut the grass today, no matter what. I needed, I needed grass. That's why it's not yielding very well. But that's fine, at least as a, at least as a answer to our question of a poor yield, even though it says it's a good yield. There we go. So yeah, we'll get this bit done here. Um, it's going to take a couple of days to... going to take a couple of days to regrow now. I need to get some uh, fertiliser up here as well. Yeah, we've got to concentrate on the new field next to us. Um, today, that's really, really important. And we will do that, like I say, while that worker finishes that, we'll just, um, finish cutting this bit of grass. By the look of it, he's, uh, he should be about finished. just no what no why are you starting to do the wrong field are oh, you freaking idiot why the hell did he go over there and do that field what a doofus What annoys me is he was going to go and do it on a bloody poor angle and all. Oh, 
now I need to get this. Oh, now I need to put the cedar in there and. Oh, what did you. I cannot believe he's just done that to me. It's gonna need liming and all, isn't it? Yeah, little bits need liming, so we're gonna have to lime the entire thing. Which means we're gonna have to rent the limer again. Ugh. Okay. Let me just park that on there. No, I can't I can't believe he's just put that in there. Frustrating. And now I've got even more work to do in this uh, in this month. I want to get into May. I'm getting into May as long as this thing's making stupid mistakes like that. This finish now. This is uh, this is just slowing me down now. Yeah, I'm hoping to not really have to cut this field again. Um, if I'm honest, I know we've got good grass in here and we've used it. I'm hoping now I can put this field 37. Put that as a, a good quality field. We'll be able to get some grass. We'll be able to get some hay out of it. You know, we'll be able to get some silage out of it. You know. Should open and be able to leave this field alone. That's the plan. Now, if the plan actually works, is another question. But we, we do like to try. Can I get this over here? Can I? I'm not sure if it reaches the trigger from this side. It does, but not very well. Come on. Yeah, so I've lost a lot of grass this time on the cut. I needed to wait till next month, but I couldn't because I just didn't have the grass. I, did, I didn't have the grass in storage. Now, I do have a hay bale left, but that's, that is literally my last uh, bale for the cows. So I didn't really want to use it on the, uh, on the sheep. As you can see, we have got this pretty much... Uh, pretty much cut now so we'll just get this last little bit we need to go and get the cedar like I say that's, that's got to be done today I want to get it done today like I say I'm a little bit annoyed that that's just put a hole in my sheep field in my sheep pen pasture whatever you want to call it um, loads of grass around these trees as well I'm not really fussed about getting that kind of grass so it's not good quality grass but if I really really needed to so that should see me over the next day or two I need at least two days now to grow to grow the new field lovely I was meant to be getting that field done today. Not a chance now, have I? Alright, so we need lime, we need fertilizer, we need we need a lot of stuff up here now. Oh, I I am I'm a little annoyed that that's really gonna screw me over like that. I knew it was a possibility that could happen, but I didn't. Yeah my own fault for trusting a worker mm. 
we on now? 10.26. Yeah, we're going to be in here for at least another month or two. We don't have a choice for this. It's going to be a busy, busy couple of months. Field 28 desperately needs uh, getting planted as well. Um, we need a roller. We need a limer. fertilizer spreader I think first things first what we'll do um, we'll jump up there get some fertilizer in that field we'll get it in the sheep one ready for the next cut we need to plant seed but I also need to put lime in the ground as well the lime's got to come next I'm really not sure what to do about these um, these stones. I don't know if I'm going to be able to bury them. I'd like to bury them because I really don't want to get a stone machine. Because the stone machine I would I'd like to use is the big one, the mod one. It's expensive to buy, and we've only got one field to do it in. We've got sixty-three thousand pounds, so we do need to look at another field. I do, I'm thinking these two here on our left hand side, 31 and 32, um, they are a joint package. Um, yeah, they are a joint package. And I think maybe that's what we'll, uh, we'll look at doing. This is this is good. Getting a nice cut of fertilizer down. We should get plenty of grass and hay off this field. Like I say, in theory, I can just make hay. I can feed the grass. Uh, I can feed the sheep grass. Uh, hay, sorry. So I could just make all hay. The thing is, it's it's an added step to not have to do if I don't need it. But if I make a large quantity of hay. Yeah, I might just make hay every time instead. I make hay every time. I know it's a bit of a waste for the uh, the sheep, but it's not the end of the world. Or I'm thinking we can just store hay, just large quantities of hay. Ah oh, crap, the gate's closed. I forgot about that. I was going to leave that open until I came back. Um, I was going to roll it to get the stage of fertilising back, but since I've now got extra work to do, I've got to come in here with the bloody... Um, cedar. Need to bring the roller up as well. We'll get there guys, we'll get there. It's gonna be a busy a busy day or so. Um I'm probably gonna just go down now, bring the cedar up. I'll pull and I won't close that gate for now. I'll get this touched up, this this one done now. Um and then I'll I'll plant grass in the next episode in uh, in thirty seven. Yeah, I didn't get as much done as I wanted to today. I, I might bring in a couple of time lapses over the next episode because we've got a lot of crop I need to get in the ground. Um, I've got a lot to gain. 28, 33, 34. They all need doing. Um, I've got the fertilizer on me. Did I miss any fertilizing fields last time? Yeah, 34 needs fertilizing. Forgot about that. Yeah, it means we can maybe put a crop in the ground as well over at 35. Um, but what I'll do before we before we plant something in field 35, a little. Like I say, I was. Oh, I'm torn again now because that's the field I've been talking about putting grass cows in. I literally we've been talking putting cows in there, leaving that as grass, and then I can just feed them cows grass. Oh, I'm torn again now. You see, this is this is my problem. I'm so. I'm so like, oh, I don't know what to do now. It's not even... Oh, whatever. 
It's not going to let me uh, do that. I've, I've driven all this way for nothing. Yeah. I was thinking then, oh, well, I could put... Um, I could put a crop in that ground, but where am I going to put my grass cows otherwise? Twenty-seven needs rolling, apparently. I forgot all about that. This is the problem when I do so much stuff, and then the next couple of days I spend it on a couple on a different map. I completely forget what and whereabouts I was in this series. Um. Yeah, I wouldn't mind, but I was looking around before I started recording today, like, oh yeah, I need to do this, I need to do that, I need to do that. And I've literally forgotten all of it. <laughs> Absolutely insane. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll get it all done. We'll get it all done, like I say, it's only 10.44 in April. We've uh, got plenty of time left. This field's now finished, so apart from rolling, we're going to have to roll the grass field as well, so... It kind of makes me want to plant that grass right now, though, to be honest. Because then I can just roll these two fields off recording. Because, like I say, rolling is the most boring job in the world. I don't really want to do it. It doesn't really benefit us. But I do like to do it for the fact that it, the game wants you to roll. Does that make sense? So well, there is that. Um... Yeah, we'll get the we'll get that bit done. As I was saying that I've got one, two, I've got four fields to plant. The problem I've got is the annoying part is liming. Don't have a lime spreader. Um, oh, it's there. Looking for my cedar. Yeah, look, we've got one hay bale left. Yeah, me hiring a worker today really, really cost me a lot. Um, like I say, having to go in and touch up the uh, field for the sheep. It's just one less job I didn't want to have to do today. Get up there. Yeah, so we're gonna have to roll this field as well. We're gonna have to touch up that field there in the sheep area. Oh, I'm just a little bit, just a little bit annoyed that the uh, worker went to plow this field. It's kind of, it has actually really annoyed me. I've always said how poor the workers are on this game and it just shows, it just proves my point. Um, and don't even get me started on the new platinum pack that's coming out where you can build roller coasters. What part of farming do you build roller coasters? Genuine question. Absolutely stupid. Oh, you can farm all this stuff and go get all this and you can build a roller coaster. Why? Why? What has it got to do with farming? Now, if it was build a roller coaster on construction simulator, I could understand. But why the hell is it wanting you to build a roller coaster on a farming game? Um, no, I won't be doing that side of the game at all. 
I'm not going to go and build a roller coaster. I am now going to go and do this grass because uh, I just want to get it done to be honest. Come on, tractor. You've got more than enough power to pull this. Why are you struggling? I need to, I need to use start using the weight on the front. This this will take like a few minutes. I say I'll, I'll roll this field off recording and I'll roll the other field off. I say I don't really like to do the rolling on on video just because, like I say, it's so freaking boring. And we don't exactly have a very big roll, so I would much prefer to just do it off the recording. Cheap area has now been fixed. In a way. Come on. Yeah, this this tractor's really struggling. It's a hundred and this tractor is two hundred and ten brake horsepower. This cedar I think wants like a hundred and fifty, is it? There shouldn't really be any problems, but it does give me some problems. We use this tractor on Attingham and we don't have a problem. We don't use the cedar though. We do only use a little baby three meter one, but yeah, this is Flo's tractor on uh, Attingham. I was going to use it on Attingham, but I brought it in on Somerset. I didn't want to be using the same tractors all the time. Hence why I'm using the Ford. Um, but the Ford is starting to be a little bit underpowered over on that series. If you haven't seen that series though guys, um, that's our co-op series. Um, genuine question though, um, not that anyone ever replies when I say this, but if people want a co-op series where it's crossplay, you need to let me know in the comments. Um, I do get some people, I get a lot of people watching the videos but for, for how small our youtube channel is i get a lot of people watching the series and i know some of those people are probably going to be xbox or playstation players if you want a cross play co-op series i'm happy to do that it would be i would use the mods that we've got but obviously when you turn crossplay on it, you know what I mean, there would be some tractors we wouldn't be able to to use because naming rights and things like that. Um, I'm not going to re-download all the mods again, just to say a lizard. So we would use what mods we could. But we could soon we could soon set up a a co-op um, crossplay. I don't know if that interests anybody, but like I say, if it does. Drop your interest below, and uh, we can maybe. I, I did have at one point a co-op uh, crossplay Twitch stream series um, over on Cams and Fam by Oxygen David. Now I'm happy to bring that back in a YouTube series. We can start from the beginning, and uh, we could do that if you want. I'm happy to do maybe something like that. I haven't really. The problem is I was doing that series and then my internet started playing up and I've not, I didn't really get a chance to finish it, you know what I mean, it just kind of ended because my internet sucks. Um, I've got, it doesn't suck with, with people connecting to me and things like that, it's just, it's just for some reason the upload is just absolutely diabolical nowadays. And Basically, what it is, is they've told me that I need to change the insert, uh, the phone cable all the time. Under the ground, not to the post though. So it's technically open reaches problem. 
they're saying BT need to pay for it, BT is saying I need to pay for it because they're saying it doesn't cover whatever. I'm not paying for them to change that cable because it's underground. I'm not going to pay to dig up the road, do you know what I mean? There's a new company in town at the moment um, who are currently installing fibre optic glass cable and in the next couple of months I will have a 2000 meg connection instead of 40 meg to give you an idea so I'm not going to be paying them thousands of pounds to dig up the road when there's another company coming in digging up the road anyway to put us in these fiber optic cables that's when live stream will return when I get a really good steady connection um, but that's that's the plan basically but I'm happy to do a, a co-op YouTube series uh, crossplay, you know, Xbox, PlayStation. You just need to let me know if it's something you want to do. Like I said, there, there are a lot of mods we wouldn't be able to use that I have installed, but we can use. The, you know what I mean? There are some out there that we still can use. Yeah, we talked about that. Uh, there we go. And this field is now going. I did say this field is only going to take a minute to do. And uh, yeah, it's a longer episode than I did plan. I didn't plan on really putting this, uh, planting this grass today. But the problem I have is I want to get this grass growing, and I kind of want to forget about this field. So like I say, I'll get this edited, and then I'll come in and I'll roll these fields what I'm recording. Because like I say, rolling is not something I'm I'm that big of a fan of. It's not exactly needed in my eyes. There we go. so we can forget about this field for seeding anyway that's the good thing yeah the reason why I um, I've not bought the other fields yet I don't think we have enough money for 31 30. I'm hoping maybe um, a field comes up in the sale you know, in, in the auction we haven't had an auction for a couple of days um, I would I would take field 30 this one just here yeah, I would take it it's a little bit bumpy but I would take that as well. That's a possibility. Right, that should be... Should be me done with this cedar. That's what I'm thinking. I shouldn't need this again. Um, yeah. Let me put it over here, out of the way for now. I'm not a hundred percent sure if I need that anymore. Plenty of eggs to sell. When's the best time for eggs? I always forget. I think it's November. Um, wrong button. Oh, saving game. Fantastic. Uh, eggs, yeah, November 2,500. Yeah, it's a full thousand pound less. Right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to I'm going to put the roller up by that field. And then I can, uh, I can go back on. I do want to have a look in the shop though, guys. For what something. Um, roller, six meters. Um, roller, 8.2 meters. So I'm thinking we need to take that roller to the shop and we need to buy the other roller. Um, how much is our roller worth actually? 
Oh, our world is. Wow, our world is worth peanuts. We'd lose 20 grand. No, we wouldn't. We'd lose. Call it two, call it fifteen hundred per year. We're gonna lose like fifteen grand. I think fifteen thousand pound is a lot of money to lose at the moment on a roller. I know it's wider. I know it's gonna be better for us. Um, that's a hundred and one thousand pounds. So we really need that to be cheaper. Um, yeah, eighty one grand. So we can't afford that either. Can't afford that. Um, could afford forty nine. If anything, I'd like to buy 27. Oh, I say it's 27. Give me a second. Feel 30, 31, 32, or 47. They're the three I'd kind of like to jump in. I don't want 38 because you've got to drive all this way to get into it. Same with 40. Um, so it's 30, 31, 32, or 47. They're, they're the fields I'd like to try and get in the next... In the next round of uh, buying fields basically um but i'm gonna run this up there i'm gonna i'm gonna roll them fields off recording but i just need to get the video edited first and get it up get it uploading on youtube because when you upload on 4g it's not the quickest connection in the world but it is reliable um but yeah guys thank you so much for watching the episode as i say if you want a cross play series if anyone watches a series who plays on console let me know in the comments below or join discord let me know um in some way i can't i can't give you what you want if i don't know about it do you know what i mean so yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next one